One of the most important causes of stomach ulcers is Helicobacter pylori infection. The same famous bacteria are the leading cause of most stomach ulcers and other stomach infections and diseases. Unfortunately, about two-thirds of people are infected with these bacteria. Because this bacterium can be easily spread without any specific symptoms. The good news is that there are many effective methods to deal with Helicobacter pylori and solve the problems it causes. If you are infected with these bacteria and suffer from a stomach ulcer, you can take practical steps to fight this disease and improve your health by eating some natural foods. Here is a list of the top 10 foods fighting Helicobacter pylori bacteria. Before we continue with the list, make sure to subscribe to Healthy Lab and turn on the notification bell to help us grow. Every subscriber is much appreciated. So, let's start. 10. Probiotics. Since Helicobacter is an unwanted bacterium in the gut, it means that probiotics can naturally fight this type of infection. A 2018 study in the Journal of Inflammation and Allergy looked at the effects of probiotics on people who tested positive for Helicobacter pylori. They found that with 8 mg of a probiotic supplement, 13 of 40 patients experienced complete eradication of Helicobacter pylori with continued treatment. Another recent study in 2019 marks a turning point in this regard common antibiotics to eradicate pylori have often failed to eradicate Helicobacter pylori, and this is because antibiotic resistance is currently spreading due to the overuse of antibiotics. Therefore, sometimes those who use antibiotics for Helicobacter not only do not destroy these bacteria but also destroy all the good bacteria that promote the health of the body. This new research has concluded that if people use antibiotics to eradicate Helicobacter pylori and take probiotics at the same time, the probability of eliminating Helicobacter pylori bacteria is higher, and its adverse effects are less. Lactobacillus casei, Lactobacillus fermentum, and Lactobacillus brevis are three special probiotic bacteria that have received more attention in scientific research for their ability to fight Helicobacter pylori bacteria, and Saccharomyces boulardii bacteria and Bifidobacterium species are also effective in the treatment of Helicobacter pylori. 9. Acetylcysteine foods. Acetylcysteine is a natural mucolytic antioxidant that destroys Helicobacter pylori biofilm. Biofilm, which is the accumulation of bacteria or microorganisms in the form of a surface layer, which is a type of polymer material, connects these organisms. As with probiotics, acetylcysteine has been shown to help treat Helicobacter pylori infection and overcome effective antibiotic therapy. The usual recommended dose is 600 mg three times a day between meals. 8. Vitamins. Vitamin C, Vitamin E, and selenium reduce the risk of stomach and esophageal cancer after treatment of Helicobacter pylori infection. This combination of antioxidant nutrients was tested in a placebo-controlled study involving thousands of people with Helicobacter pylori. The researchers followed up with the patients for seven years. Long-term antioxidant supplementation is significantly associated with reduced stomach and esophageal cancer mortality. A high-quality, high-strength multivitamin and mineral supplement should include vitamin C, vitamin E, and selenium in amounts close to those used in the study above. However, you may need more vitamin C to reach the full daily dose of 500. 7. Nigella sativa. Nigella sativa has many proven benefits, including fighting Helicobacter pylori infections. Research since 2015 showed that in patients with Helicobacter bacteria, the daily consumption of 2 grams of Nigella sativa powder together with acid reducer is more effective in treating Helicobacter than the usual triple treatment of acid reducers and two different antibiotics. This study concludes that Nigella sativa has medically beneficial anti-pylori activity, compared to triple therapy. Nigella sativa is also acid reducing and has the ability to protect the digestive system. 6. Broccoli sprouts. Broccoli sprouts are small broccolis that have only been growing for a few days. They contain high amounts of a sulfur-containing chemical substance called sulforaphane. Sulforaphane is a compound that is known for its antioxidant and detoxifying uses. Broccoli sprouts are utilized to make broccoli seed oil for topical use as well as special supplements for internal use. Research published in the Journal of Gastrointestinal Diseases and Sciences found that 78% of subjects who consumed broccoli sprouts twice daily for one week tested negative for Helicobacter pylori at the end of the seventh day. Six of the people tested negative on the 35th day of the study. In fact, 
A 2017 study published in the Journal of Current Pharmaceutical Design showed that the sulforaphane in broccoli can not only fight against Helicobacter pylori and gastritis it causes but can also help protect against gastrointestinal damage caused by dangerous nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drugs. 5. Green Tea Green tea, hot or cold, is not just a popular drink for weight loss purposes. Green tea also inhibits the growth of Helicobacter pylori bacteria. Laboratory studies show the profound effects of green tea against Helicobacter and, more importantly, show that green tea consumption prevents inflammation of the digestive mucosa when exposed to Helicobacter contamination. This research concludes that green tea is a natural substance that can be used to prevent and treat the disease caused by Helicobacter. Other research reveals that catechins, especially the epigallocatechin gallates in green tea, have strong antibacterial power. When it comes to fighting Helicobacter pylori bacteria, green tea is an excellent catechin source. 4. Garlic Garlic is a natural anti-inflammatory food and even has natural antibiotic properties. Eating cooked and raw garlic may help kill Helicobacter bacteria. A 2017 study found that people with Helicobacter pylori who consumed two medium cloves of garlic daily with lunch and dinner significantly reduced the number of bacteria. This suggests that garlic has specific antibacterial effects against Helicobacter pylori. 3. Propolis Propolis is a resinous compound collected by honeybees from a number of plant sources that are used to maintain the wax's apparent structure. According to the chemical composition of propolis, scientists found that it actually contains 300 natural beneficial compounds. These compounds include amino acids, coumarins, phalaldehydes, quinines, and steroids. Several studies have shown that propolis extract, which is available as a supplement, is able to inhibit the growth of Helicobacter pylori bacteria, thanks to its high number of phenolic compounds. As propolis is a gum that bees collect from buds and other parts of plants. This wax has many antibacterial and antifungal properties. Propolis is a natural antibiotic that strengthens the body's immune system and fights against infectious diseases. This gummy substance also helps to treat problems such as gastritis. Due to its properties, propolis can repel Helicobacter. 2. Ginger Ginger has been known and used for its countless medicinal properties for centuries. This medicinal plant has excellent effects on the digestive system. Traditional medicine experts recommend ginger to deal with stomach acidity, nausea, heartache, stomach ulcers, and other digestive system ulcers. According to researchers, ginger has strong antibacterial power and thus can destroy Helicobacter pylori. Ginger rhizome appears to have anti-Helicobacter pylori activity through its various phenolic combinations. 1. Cabbage Cabbage contains effective compounds that are useful for fighting and eliminating Helicobacter pylori. Of course, all these benefits will be provided if you eat this vegetable raw. It's high in vitamin C, an antioxidant that helps control and treat Helicobacter pylori infections. These conditions are the most common reason for stomach ulcers. Actually, several animal investigations reveal that cabbage juice is helpful at treating and controlling a wide range of digestive ulcers like those affecting the stomach. In humans, early examinations observed that daily use of fresh cabbage juice seemed to help heal stomach ulcers and Helicobacter pylori more effectively than the conventional treatment operated at the time. Usually, after diagnosing Helicobacter pylori, your doctor will give nutritional and non-nutritional recommendations to improve this disease. First of all, you will probably be advised to take antibiotics to control the infection. Managing stress and avoiding smoking are other basic recommendations for shortening the treatment period of Helicobacter pylori. Thank you for watching, and we are looking forward to seeing you in the next video.